now look into this now doctor i was telling you this is the cervix dilatation dear doctor this is the cervix dilatation which is marked as a x cervix dilatation which is marked as a s that is in centimeters from 1 to what doctor from 0 to 10 centimeter please make it as 0 to 10 centimeter so cervix dilatation marked as a x so now each square on y axis look into this each square on y axis corresponds to dilatation of cervix look into each square on y axis corresponds to dilatation of cervix means one square represents one centimeter dilatation of cervix you got the point doctor one square represents doctor one square represents one centimeter dilatation of cervix and each square on that is two squares on x axis represents one hour two squares on x axis represents one hour okay yes that is the one thing so each square on x axis represents time in what doctor time in what time in hours and each square represents one hour this is one square understood doctor this is a one square within this one square how many small squares are there two small squares so two small squares is equal to one hour or one big square is equal to one hour you got the point doctor you can look into this this is a one big square within this one big square how many small squares yes definitely two small squares that's why two squares is equal to one hour or one big square is equal to one hour whatever it may be okay yes now so now time duration now doctor look into this so there are two lines in the cervical dilatation area this is the alert line look into this this is the alert line and this is the action line this is the action line you got the point doctor so two lines in the cervical dilatation area from 4 cm to 10 cm if you see the alert line and action line starts from 4 cm yes so that's why two lines in the cervical dilatation area Yes, that is alert line and action line. The time gap between the alert line and action line is 4 hours. Time gap between the alert line and action line is what doctor? 4 hours. And doctor, alert line is plotted based on the principle that, alert line is plotted based on the principle that in active phase, minimum cervical dilatation will be 1 centimeter per hour. That is the principle of plotting the alert line. Plotting the alert line. You got the point, doctor? So, alert line is plotted based on the principle that, yes, in active phase, whenever the woman reaches active phase, minimum cervical dilatation will be what, doctor? 1 centimeter per hour. 1 centimeter per hour. And every fourth hourly, doctor, every fourth hourly, we will do per vaginal examination and we will plot a photograph. Every fourth hourly, we will we will do per vaginal examination and plot a photograph. They are all the golden points. Two lines in the cervical dilatation in the alert and action line. Yes, 4 centimeter to 10 centimeter. So, alert line plotted based on the principle that in active phase, minimum cervical dilatation will be 1 centimeter per hour. And every fourth hourly, we will do what, doctor? Per vaginal examination. Yes.